consensus in the industry was you can't have a muzzle brake and a flash hider and combine them. It won't work. And certainly the way that it was done, it didn't work. This isn't well known throughout the industry, but muzzle brakes are dangerous. So the challenge for us was to develop a device that would cut the recoil, act as a blast averter, breaking down the blast overpressure safely, directing it forward, so that anything basically from here back, you're not getting the concussive effect. Using complex flow, you can see a huge amount of microstructures in the device. And at the end, you have these bypass ports that angle down near to the bore. And so that's bypassing the gases, moving them down the device, and then as they expand, compress, expand, compress, expand, and compress, you're creating forward thrust. And that's how we're able to divert the blast forward, but still not increase recoil, but reduce recoil. 